Hello viewers, welcome to another interesting video. Today we will learn how to download a program in S7200 PLC. Now the MLAB number is visible. We are using the same cable PC adapter USB A2. Using software Microwin Service Pack 9. When the software opens, first of all we have to establish the communication between the PC and the PLC. To establish the communication, we have to go to communication header. Here, look carefully. Network parameter is PC adapter USB A2. Protocol is Profibus. And baud rate is 9.6 kbps. We will click on set PGPC interface. Now we will go to parameters. In parameters, here it is selected PGPC is the only master on the bus. And transmission rate 9.6 kbps. Profile DP. Now we will click on OK. We will click on OK. Double click to refresh. Now the PC is trying to detect the PLC. It takes a little bit time. Trying to detect the PLC. Here the PLC has been detected by the software. CPU 226CN is shown. We can confirm it. CPU 226CN. Now in order to download the program, first we have to load the PLC backup program from the specific location. We are selecting the program from the specific location. Now the program has been loaded in the software itself. Now we can easily forward to download the program into the PLC. This is the download button. We will click on it. Some minor error has been popped up. We can easily ignore the error and we can proceed to download. Asking to stop the PLC right now. We have given the permission. The download procedure has been started. It can be seen that the activity LED is glowing. The downloading has been done successfully, asking to put the PLC in run mode. Now we can see that the PLC is in run mode right now. I would like to request all my viewers to subscribe my channel and like the video. Apart from downloading, today we will learn some other tricks also. How to set the time in PLC. Here, we will read the time from the PC, that's why I will click on read. And after that, we have to click on set. Now the time has been set in the PLC. To prevent the unauthorized access into the PLC program, we can set the password for the program itself. For this, we have to select password protect this project and give the password and verify the password. In this way, we can protect the program. Thank you the viewers.